Well, my 13-year-old daughter over the summer started to grow horizontally instead of vertically. It's not what you're thinking. Just like right in this area right here, started to grow out of the side <laughs> so she could put her hand on it. She kind of moves her head now when she talks. Does anybody else have this 13-year-old? <laughs> it's just me. It's just my bad parenting that caused this. <laughs> my daughter is a rock star. She's the coolest kid ever. Kids love her. Parents love her. Every coach that's ever coached her love her. I wouldn't change a hair on her head. She's perfect. But when she's talking to me with that hand on her hip, and her head moving back and forth. I don't care what she's saying to me. I feel like she's talking back to me. <laughs> Dad, we made you breakfast in bed. Happy Father's Day. <laughs> Go to your room right now. <laughs> that is unacceptable. <laughs> but it turns out, we found out, she's got scoliosis. <laughs> Okay, ma'am, you're horrible for laughing at that. I don't know what. You're bent over laughing at the scoliosis. I don't even know what that's, what's happening right there. This is not a joke. My daughter has a 60 degree curve in the bottom of her spine and a 35, 45 degree curve in the top of her spine makes a huge S, which she said was for Savannah. She's like, Dad, you're not gonna stop talking about me on stage, are you? I was like, nope. So I'm not making fun of the disability that my daughter has. I'm not making it up. It's a true story. She had a miraculous surgery that was incredible. On her 14th birthday, all through the summer, cut her back open, the doctor did. 20 inch scar down the back, fused 13 of her vertebra to two titanium rods, put 26 three inch screws, two per vertebra all the way up, seven hour procedure, seven units of blood, seven nights in the hospital, seven weeks in the bed, seven months of rehab. 30 years ago, she would have been nine months in a body cast before she could walk. And the night of her surgery, because of new technology, they needed to change her sheets and she just hopped up from the bed and moved out of the way. And a lot of crowds clap right then, but I can tell you I don't care at all. No, no, stop, it's way too late. There was a clear window. There was a clear window where you could have proved that you had a soul and you failed miserably. God knows your heart. But she said, Dad, you're the only dad conservative enough to have his daughter's back fused to two titanium rods just so I'll never be able to twerk. <laughs> I was like, I would have done that when you were five, Savannah. I didn't know. I didn't know.